captured by that. Yeah, help! Don't worry, amigo. We're not going to kill you. We only want to ask you a few questions. First, how much do you know about us? Just that you stole the cargo that was on the governor's transport. The governor himself has ordered your capture. How do you guys know it was us? The radio. We overheard you talking on the radio after the transport crashed. Listen. Yet after the kill word. What? Trafer. Please tell me you changed the frequency after you heard that uh, distress call from the transport. No, I didn't. I just turned the volume, volume down because it was so loud. Jeffar, I'm gonna kill you! Ah, help! Do you know what the transport was carrying? No. You were not told anything about that. Get back here, J4! Ah, I'm sorry, Daryl! Don't hurt me! Easy, Daryl. We have more important things to worry about now. Don't we? <laughs> I guess you're right. Schaefer, I'll kill you later. What base are you stationed at? Gwinerama? Gwinerama? Probably butchering names of Venezuelan cities. That was fast. Why the loose tongue? I do not want to die. Besides, it's not that we are fighting for some great purpose. We are just doing our jobs. Isn't secession from the UCS a great purpose for you? No, not for us. Never mind. Show us where your base is. Hmm. We are literally joining the enemy. Eastern Venezuela. Guinarama base. Hey, that's pretty close. You're UCS soldiers, yes? Why don't you know where our bases are? <laughs> because they're incompetent? Because the three of us aren't really interested in this war. We're like you. We don't have a great purpose worth fighting for. And also because we've always hating doing, hated doing our homework. Why are they so proud of that? I mean, okay, people call you a slacker, but uh, usually the slackers are like... Uh, they just feel misunderstood. They don't take pride. What will we want with the state army base? We need a new truck. Yes, yeah, so? It's a military base. They should have one big enough for us, right? So we're gonna steal another truck? No, we're only trading our old one for one of theirs. Sorry for leaving you tied up there, amigo. I'm sure your buddies will come and find you sh soon enough. What? Alright. He's like, okay. Thanks for just tying me up and leaving me here. It's not as if uh, anything's gonna happen to me meanwhile. Oh. And we need, your, we need your uniform too. I need your clothes, your boots, and your bike. Or whatever he said. And your bike keys, I think is what he said. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> it's like, all right, they're gonna strip me. It's par for the course. You people are strange. You do not act like soldiers. Oh yeah, they act like mercenaries. You're not the first ones to tell us that. But we like the way we are. And your boots, clothes, and motorcycle, okay. Boarding via corruption for God knows how long. 
Okay, Mort. What do we have now? What new trials and tribulations await us? We're going from the Guillermo base or Guirama, Guinerama base to. Oh, I see, I see, I see. We hadn't yet gone there. This is the base. We're not yet. We weren't at the base when we were talking to those uh, guys. Daryl, there. Yeah? I'm in the base. Roger that. We're ready to give you covering fire if anything goes wrong. Oh, they're gonna attack the base! Holy shit! What did you do with the crate? I managed to convince one of the mechanics here to bring it into the base with a forklift. All I need to do now is to load it onto the truck and get it out. Okay, okay. So this guy is dressed like... Uh, I, I guess he managed to infiltrate inside because he's dressed like one of them, right? But don't they have more identification than that? I hope we don't have to fight again. Wait, someone's coming. Daryl out. VSA officer. Venezuelan State Army, presumably. So we are currently preparing to send out a search party. What's Diaz himself here? I don't care about soldiers who fail to do their job. I have not come all the way from Caracas to listen to your excuses. What about the Caligo? So that's Governor Diaz. We are still searching for it, sir. But the UCS soldier who stole it could not have gone far. We know their names and they are bound to pass through one of our checkpoints. I hope so, for your sake. Now, about the contents of the crate. The men who intercepted the radio transmissions have been instructed not to tell anyone. Aside from them, I'm the only one who knows, sir. Oh shit, so there are more people who know what's in the crate. Oh, this is gonna get real ugly. Everyone's gonna make... Everyone's gonna want uh, all that gold. Good. Don't worry, Commander. You have nothing to worry about. But we need to find that crate as soon as possible. <laughs> this government sounds like a real crook. Now I feel better about taking this... Taking his gold stash. I guess I've seen enough. It's time for me to ditch this place. Uh, probably not gonna work out. But let's see, maybe we have a GTA type escape mission. Steel truck is right there in the menu. And I guess that was a piece of cake. Why are you keeping the... Great, so exposed, idiots! Hey, I haven't seen you before. Why are you wearing a pilot suit? What pilot suit? You talking to Daryl? Well, I was ordered to bring this truck to headquarters in Caracas. Orders? Whose orders? Uh, it was... Uh, what's his name? You know, the guy with the beard. Alright, let's see some ID. The guy with the beard, alright. I told you, it was a... Uh, uh, uh... Your ID, now! Uh oh Oh, the hell with this. Major, <laughs> stop! Sound the alarm! Ooh, Mage Rage? Ah! Shut the alarm! I want to hear the music! Hello! That was only a checkpoint, was it? We have to fight!
Unfortunately, they couldn't have shown him his ID. Object destroy all enemy units as always. Ah, is that great? Yes, that is it. What are you waiting for? Go after them. Yes, sir. We will send out all available fonsors. It's on the way! I do not care how many men or how many fonsors it takes. Just get that crate back! Hmm, I wonder I wonder how the fuck they managed to follow an asshole like this. Alright, enemy composition, please. Camera. Oh god, how many how many of them are there? Can we have a list of all the enemies? Weapons. Quick save battle windows. What is battle windows? Normal, small, off. Default speed, display objectives, give up. <laughs> so, those options didn't work out. How do we see... How many enemies there are? We could see it in tactics, but I guess we just have to rely on uh, the red bars near there. Uh... Oh, there's a turret! Oh, let's let's kill this guy first. So turret body, 500 HP. My God, we just don't have the DPS for this. I feel so underleveled. Base cannon, uh, damage 19 to. Oh, it's a cannon. 19 to 1 Defense for random AP5 So if we go right next to him He should not be able to attack us No, I don't want melee Cat's Ray Yeah, but Cat's Ray is hardly going to do any damage no, let's go with melee and uh, hope for the best. What's the accuracy though? 87... No wait, 0% accuracy is it? Or did we get 87%? What is a 0%? Okay, okay, okay. 0% is my accuracy. Wait a minute. So my accuracy was the one in blue. So far I've been looking at the red accuracy. Idiot. So we're gonna attack him with melee. Okay. Accuracy is 75% and 87% and counter attack. But the cannon is not supposed to be able to counter attack. Right? Yeah, I don't know. Not bad, not bad. Oh, that upgrade helped us out. Ow! That is debated quite a bit of damage to him. I'm happy about that. Rengus, I think you can attack him from here itself. We get accuracy of 91%. No skill aim. Uh, so we get to select which skill we want to use. I just go with no skill, 91% is good enough for me. Nice! He's He's starting to do so much more damage damage now. So maybe 500 damage is pretty manageable now. Or he's got 12 AP. I wish I wish the other fonsors had some AP upgrades. Let me finish him off. 67% accuracy. Okay, okay. Now that I see how much accuracy we are re quote unquote really getting, it makes sense that so many of our attacks miss. Hopefully he'll get two turns. Crap damage though. Alright, how many fonses are we going to get uh, attacking us this turn? None! Oh, I didn't even notice that all the tur turret! Missed. Awesome. 
but it does change our orientation. Get wrecked. Block damage. I wonder why that, that specific skill triggered. Alright. I think we can finish him off this turn and we'll go after the next turret. But how? I don't want a whole bunch of guys on me next on. Why can't you attack him? Makes no sense. Why can't you attack him with a shotgun? For some stupid reason, he can't attack him. Aha! So we can go here and attack the other turret. You know what, Rengis, you finish it off. Actually, now that I think about it... No, it's fine. It's fine. Rengis can just stay in one position because of the awesome range he's got. And everybody else can just move around here and there. So I think what I want to do is attack from max range whenever possible. Is he going to counter? 0% counter attack, okay. So this is just going to be a free hit for us. Not much of a free hit though, like 28 damage, pathetic. Diaz was like, all Vonzos, go and attack them. And the reality here is that everybody's just chilling because nobody cares. Nobody actually cares about him. Oops, wait, what? 90%. Okay, that's still fine. So the general formula I'm going to follow here is just attack with Rengis first and then try and finish off uh, with my other guys. Is it expected to retake Venezuela in a week? No, no. Diaz, Diaz was talking about uh, sending all of their sponsors. Fifty-eight percent. Is it because of height? Kill him. Three HP. Son of a bitch. Okay, one of the fonzers is coming towards us now. Two fonzers coming towards us. Uh, okay, can 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 be dealt with. Thank god the turret is absolutely hopeless. Benzo and Army obviously is oh, okay, okay, that's what you meant. Got it. So question now is yeah, you know what? I'll have I'll finish this guy off with uh, <coughs> uh our weakest weakest offensive character here, since we only need three damage. It's good that everyone gets experience. So we don't have to worry about, you know, optimizing, should attack, and all that stuff. Wonder if I should just save some AP here. What do these guys have? Tempest, what the fuck is Tempest? Light buster, light buster. Okay, this guy's purely melee, it seems. So he's gonna take a while to reach us. Uh, what does this guy have? Gale and Gale. That's a shotgun, shotgun. Awesome. This guy's got two shotguns on him. Yeah, yeah. I'll just, I'll just uh, stay at my original location. 
and make sure that Rengis can take pot shots at them. Unfortunately, there's just no way he's going to counter attack because it takes six freaking AP. Nice. Uh, maybe I should take this chance to repair. switch to someone else no I don't want that how do we switch to someone else no not the enemy damn it oh I see I see I see only Daryl's turn actually remains I used up the white mage's turn in uh, combat okay I'll position Daryl here so that he'll have 8 AP. Actually, no. Um, he only needs 6 AP to counter attack twice. So, yeah, I'll position him here and he will counter attack. I think it should be fine. Look at me. Thinking tactics and all. I'm sure it's going to go horribly wrong. But hey, at least I put in the effort. Alright, he's attacking Daryl. Not the guy who I initially thought would be attacking me, but uh, it's 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 all good. Let's let's counter attack without cat three. Twelve damage No, not twice. Hello What? How did you not attack twice? Now you can't counter attack. Did he not have 6 AP? Oh, thank God for that miss. Uh, I need to heal his legs. Uh, you know, now that I think about it, his sponsor is kind of fragile. Please attack twice. Oh god damn, he's got some evasion. Uh Rangus you just stay there and uh yeah let's let's go after the machine gunner first. Melee how much HP does he have? Oh wow 600 on his body, he's got a lot of HP on his body. Destroyed his legs, okay. Guess that works. Who needs to heal? Everybody kinda seems fine, but I'll just heal Rengus nonetheless. There we go, up to four. Is everybody gonna attack Daryl? So far it does look that way. Okay. 3 minus 3. Oh, I see, I see, I see. So, I had 9 AP. No, I moved. I had 10 AP at the beginning of the turn. I used 1 to move. And I used 3 times 2, 6 AP to attack. And now I get to counter attack once. Yeah, yeah, I'm completely okay with this. Or maybe I should counter attack with melee. But then uh, I won't be able to counter attack again. You know what? Let's just go with the shotgun. We've been having relatively good success with this strategy so far. If he won't evade... Oh wait, that's me. That's me evading. Never mind. Can't counter the melee guy now. Need to heal uh, Daryl's legs. So 
Excellent. All good. All good. Attack. I'm going to heal him first. You know what? Heal him first. It's kind of convenient that they're going all after Daryl. Full heal? Holy crap, that's a full heal. Seriously, the healer is so OP, man. Oh my god. Man, Rengus. He just, he's just annihilating everything. Good body shot there. Okay, this guy's melee, so let's go out of range. So far it's looking rather simple, this mission. And we get to attack him twice, without fear of a counter-attack. And what's even better is that we'll get to counter-attack him when he tries to attack us. Alright, another monster coming towards us. Another couple of monsters coming towards us. Yeah, yeah, I think we can handle it. Nice. I think I think it'll take a while to finish this guy off. Good body shot. I'm wondering if I should just not bother healing Daryl this time? And just uh, try and f try and attack him with the machine gun. Nah. Still got way too much HP. But I think we got at least one more turn before the other two Fonsors uh, get on us. Let's check out their... <coughs> Excuse me. Let's check out their configuration. Huskies with more shotguns. Okay, we can deal with shotguns. And you are a Tempest with melee again. Alright, alright. So another, basically, another wave of the same stuff that we fought, fought uh, last couple turns. Yeah, I think we'll be fine. We'll just, we'll just try and attack this guy. Get as much damage in as possible. It's not a lot from uh, what's his name, Schaefer, but it's something. And it's not as if he's being targeted anyway. All right, they're on to us now. I I need to finish this guy off quickly. Melee! Oh. Another body shot. Definitely need to heal next turn. Which is fine. Uh, Rangus goes first, or... Hmm... He's still got 240 HP on the body. So if he gets a body shot, that might work out pretty well for me. Yeah, let's, let's, let's go with that. Huh, left arm destroyed, but he's got uh, melee weapons on both his arms. So that doesn't really help us. Repair body, healed all the way up to full. Jeez. Will I ever get used to the healer? You know, the fact that we have, uh, we have basically unlimited healing means that I'm gonna get into some real tough shit once we are out of this introductory phase of the game. Oh boy. And if these missions are taking this long, I shudder to think about how much, uh, how long the other missions are gonna be. Got three, how much AP do I have? I have only three AP. Go for it. He's gonna get, he's, is he gonna attack twice? Yeah, he's gonna attack twice. That's fine. Okay, that melee Fonsor. 
and this guy only has a move of one so for now he's not a threat to us let's fo let's focus on uh, the guy guy right next to us up there enough HP why didn't you counter attack? huh nice body shot oh my god I be able to finish off this guy uh it's a vain hope but we need seven seven oh no we need a total of three hits on the body but this guy doesn't even get three hits on uh, all of his stuff much less on the body okay never mind never mind he got three hits on the body well done well done chafer you don't suck and that's more than expected I mean, you don't suck as an offensive. As a repairman, you're like the most valuable unit, hands down. Right? Melee guy, he he's lost his legs. That's why he's unable to move more than one tile. Let's finish finish him off first. How much? How much is? How much HP does he have? One sixty to one thirty five. Maybe shotgun will be able to finish him off. Oh, that's right. The shots do not retarget. That's what uh, Hunger 15 told me last time, didn't he? Can uh, Schaefer be the hero again? Oh my god, this is unbelievable. So, so parts, which, so shots which are supposed to hit their body parts will just miss if those body parts are just not present. That's unfortunate. Definitely helps that the enemy comes towards us in waves. So far, I seem to have found a relatively straightforward formula for playing the game at least these missions with with the setup that we have wonder when we are going to get access to you know like customize our font source actually buy new parts and stuff awesome Press A to win. Keep A press. Actually, nah. Can't keep A press. Sadly. Go to mash A to win. Ooh, you waited that all. That's fine. That's fine. You've done your job, Chafer. I don't. I don't like the music so far. Not. Absolutely no competition to Front Mission 3. Uh, do I want to heal his right arm? Might as well. Might as well. Like, what have, what have we got to lose? That's unfortunate. He dodged the first shot. But uh, this mission is all but one. Assuming nothing bad happens. Uh, at right now. And the reason I keep expecting bad things to happen is because of Fire Emblem. I've lost all faith in uh, tactics games. When you start getting reinforcements. Just when you thought uh, you won the mission. And why didn't he heal? Could have healed his right arm. God damn it! Still, we've got restore as well. So don't think, don't don't. This is gonna be an issue. Uh, 
Okay, it was just a body shot. That's that's fine. Let's just go on the offensive. Why even bother? Missed. Okay, that's a that's a disadvantage of a shotgun. Oh, what skill do we have? Terror shot. And wow, he he was not supposed to evade that. He was not supposed to evade that. That's rather unfortunate. And this bastard is taking longer than uh, other three panzers combined. You know what? I'm just gonna melee him because uh, shotguns are definitely not as powerful as Front Mission 3. At least melee he will hit some body part. Shotguns are just starting to miss, miss everything. Okay, hit his legs. I was like, which body part did you hit again, asshole? Let me take a pot shot with Rengis first. So there are both you know, advantages and disadvantages for both burst weapons and uh, and single target. I mean, batch damage weapons, single single shot weapons. I like that. I like that. I like they rebalanced it. Yeah, I call it a rebalance. Oh no, I'm going with melee. I call it a rebalance because burst weapons are just so good. I guess to compensate for some of the disadvan disadvantages, machine guns and shotguns here, they will uh, they'll, they will attack twice, but they also have uh, AP requirements. So anybody who wants to be a machine gunner or a shotgunner, he needs to have good AP. Or for that matter, rifle as well, because just a single shot of the rifle takes 6 AP, Jesus. What do we get? All the money and we get... 30... Why the hell did people get different AP amounts? Okay, 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 okay. They, they already had some AP left over. So we got 30 E... Sorry, not AP. EP. What is EP again? I forgot what EP is. Experience points? Yeah, I think it's experience points. What are you waiting for? Send the rest of the troops out! That's that. <coughs> we took out all the ones as we could muster. And I cannot send infantry against them. Oh shit, please don't send infantry, they're so annoying. I told you, I do not care what it takes, send them! The enemies are not fronts, sir. I cannot send my men to be slaughtered. Oh, this guy's a pretty nice general. Officer, whatever. Are you telling me you will disobey a direct orders? Apparently so. What are they doing now? They're just keeping an eye on us. I don't think they have any operational bonzers left. If we're gonna make a run for it, we should do it now. <laughs> They're just keeping an eye on you. <laughs> like all of the infantry are like, oh shit, we're out of bonzers. Grand total of. It's time for us to say adios. They had a grand total of about five panzers. Adios, amigos. Or it looks like our escape was successful. No, it's getting away. My gold, my gold. <laughs> Theory 